Well, we have just learned new details about a violent crash that killed two people last night. Dan Edwards is live with new information in the investigation this morning. And we're along 741 this morning in Moraine, and at the crest of that bridge is where the accident occurred. And According to witnesses, one car went left of center at a high rate of speed, and this is the dramatic result. Two cars barely recognizable from this violent impact on 741 near Cobblegate last night around 9. Moraine police believe this white Impala is responsible, carrying three males. According to police, two of the three men inside did not make it. The third is airlifted to Kettering Medical Center, as well as the female driver of this Buick, nearly cut in half by the impact, also seriously hurt. Police tell us a third car was hit by flying debris from that crash, but the driver was uninjured. Uh, as stunned bystanders look on in disbelief, numerous first responders from Moraine fire clear up the mess left behind, closing 741 for several hours while investigators kind of reconstruct the accident scene. Of course, as you see now, really no issue with traffic this morning, so not going to hamper your drive into work this morning, but we did contact the Montgomery County Coroner's Office. We do know the names now of the two deceased, 23-year-old Philip Lane Jr. of Dayton, as well as 24-year-old Eric Sanford of Dayton, now died from this crash. Reporting live in Moraine, Dan Edwards, 2 News Today, working for you.